Well, this isn't going to be an everyday video that I normally do, but it is a video I need to do for the Kiwani Ski Club here in Iron Mountain, Michigan. So we're in charge of the Pine Mountain Ski Jump and the Continental Cup. It's an international ski jumping tournament that comes here every year. We are responsible to get the ski jump ready. And one of the responsibilities that we need to do is to ice the ski jump. Now, this process you're about to see, I recorded last year. Um, it was the very first time that we did it, but I want to give members that may do this in the future an idea of what it takes to actually ice the ski jump. So for years before, we would spend weeks on the ski jump trying to get it ready before a Continental Cup. But with this brand new technology of top speed and this ski jump, we're able to do it in a day. We can ice the ski jump, let it freeze, come back the next day, cut the track, and it's pretty much ready to go. There's not a lot of work. There's not a lot of work involved if you compare it to what we used to do. Now, I will tell you, we have to do this when it's cold. We have to do this when it's below freezing, oftentimes windy. So if you're watching this video right now because you're planning to volunteer this year or any other year, dress warm. Many, many layers. Expect the worst. Trust me, expect the worst. Anyway, watch this video. It's going to give you an idea because we are literally putting slush. It's not even, it, it's more slushy than it is thick. And we're putting it right on the ski jump. We're taking uh, uh, these little, you'll see them, where we're tamping it down into the track. And it's going to freeze in place. But we got to go all the way up to the top. Anyway, watch this video. Kind of learn a little bit more. And I hope to see you at the Pine Mountain Ski Jump this year when we ice the track. Two waters, three snow.
Alright, well I hope this was sort of an informational video for you. I hope you kind of understood what was going on. If you're a Kiwani Ski Club member, you're going to learn a lot more about it in person. And, uh, well, I hope you have fun on your venture with us. Anyway, these are all 100% volunteers. Nobody gets paid for working on this tower. Nobody's getting paid to ice the ski jump. We're all volunteers. We all do it because we love it. So if you would, make sure to hit the thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button. If you're not a subscriber, you might be interested. I do shoot a lot of train videos. So if you like trains, you're going to like this channel. And uh, make sure to make a comment below. Are you a Kiwani Ski Club member? Do you want to be one? We're always looking for volunteers. We need to build our club up. So again, we're hoping this video, maybe it's something, maybe this is something that you want to do, that you'd like to do. We're open arms. We're waiting for you. Anyway, have a great day, and we are looking forward to a competition this year, the first week of March 2023. That is our official date, the first weekend of March 2023. We'll hope to see you there.